Hey. What's wrong? For 12 years now, Peter Holworth has been a sort of foster parent to hundreds of sick little seals that wash up on his shore. Okay, little guy. There we go. This one was near death from starvation when he found it. What's going on, little guy? Apparently swept away That's from its mother in a heavy surf. Okay, we'll get you fed. Under a federal permit, Peter runs a nonprofit clinic that nurses these babies back to health. Good stuff, huh? This pup nearly doubled in size in 10 days. No place has more seals than the waters near Santa Barbara. Before the practice was stopped, collectors came here to fill our circuses and zoos. Peter Holworth was the last of those hunters. He could snare anything. One day off this coast, Peter caught a pilot whale. Other whales circled closely as he towed it toward shore, each in turn trying to comfort the one that was caught. As Peter neared the surf, their cries faded. But the song they had sung changed his life. I felt really rotten inside. I said to myself, I don't want to do this anymore. He stopped collecting and dedicated his days to restoring the hurt and the orphaned to the sea. Volunteers alert Holworth to animals in trouble. If a seal is injured, Peter takes along Dr. Arthur Posh, a veterinarian. Oh, come on. They have seen to it that broken bones were fixed, cataracts removed, and once even had a new lens implanted in a seal's eye. Peter receives no pay for this work, but has made a living from the sea all his life and feels an obligation. Here we go, Pete. There's so many people and everybody's taking things, take, 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 take this, take that, that sooner or later you have to start giving something back. The hunter is now the helper. Bob Dotson, NBC News, Santa Barbara.